announced just hours ago is why a Green Bay police officer is on paid administrative leave after allegations of misconduct. Officer M Matthew Knutson faces two charges, including misconduct in public office, a felony charge, and negligent operation of a vehicle, a misdemeanor. Emily Beyer was at that press conference today and shares the reasons behind those charges. Emily. Yeah, Cammy. today we learned these allegations come after a traffic stop in November of 2021. Now, the police chief not able to answer many questions here today, but we did see that camera video. We want to warn you, some of you at home may find this difficult to watch. Put your arms behind your back. Put your arms behind your back. This dash cam video is the center of a criminal investigation against a Green Bay police officer. Hey, Brian. It's on for Hey, Brian. I'm good. Hey, Brian. I just have one I had nobody. Police say the driver, 47 year old Robert Sanchez of Green Bay, was suspected of attempting to flee after Officer Matthew Knutson, a 13 year veteran of the department, tried to pull him over for failing to yield the right of way near Manitowoc Road and Bader Street. Get back in the car! Other officers responded to the area to help. Officers find Sanchez running near Manitowoc Road. They yell at him to stop. Officials saying Get Sanchez appears to not listen and they're unable to see his hands. They run after him, using a taser on him as he enters the roadway on Imperial Lane. Taser, taser, taser! Oh. In the next moments, the video shows Robert Sanchez walking off the roadway into the grass. We then see Officer Knudsen in his squad car drive off the road and hit Sanchez from behind. Get on the ground! Put your arms behind your back. Robert Sanchez was then taken into custody, but according to court records, the charges were dropped. But Knutson is facing two criminal charges, including a felony. Now, these charges are new, but Officer Knutson has been suspended before. That's the environment depicted in statements and interviews from 29 people. Our Sarah Thompson first reporting on a 2018 internal investigation naming Matt Knudsen as one of the officers involving harassment of a fellow officer, resulting in a 30-day suspension. At the press conference, I asked if these prior investigations will impact any decisions made for Officer Knudsen's future. Employee discipline case is one of the things that I will consider when if we get to the point where there is a sustained allegation in this case, uh, it would be appropriate for me to consider previous disciplinary history and making a, a corrective action decision in this case. But we're not at that point in the process. The criminal and administrative investigation for Officer Knutson is ongoing. Now, Officer Knutson is currently on paid administrative leave. The police chief said the ongoing investigation will need to wrap up first before a decision is made on whether Officer Knutson will face corrective action or termination. Reporting live in Green Bay, Emily Byer, Action 2 News.